Okay, we are currently at the hospital. Jansen is seven centimeters dilated. The nurse just left. The water has been broken. There's water everywhere. Just kidding. There's not water everywhere. <laughs> but uh, what time did we get here? Say hi to Mama. Hi. She has the epidural, so she's feeling good. And now we're in the labor and delivery room. I said she's seven centimeters dilated already. They said a centimeter per hour. If she's on, if she follows the correct normal schedule. And so now we're self quarantine in the labor and delivery room. And this video is brought to you by West Penn Hospital, where caring hands and caring hearts are present. Also, I have a cup of coffee on the way because it is looking like it might be a long night. Also, I, I didn't shave the past two days because when the baby entered the world, I wanted them to realize and make sure that they knew that I was, I was their dad. Stay tuned for more. All right, so I'm back. I wanted to share with you all the uh, thing that tells us the contractions that she's having. Pretty regular, doing great. Based on my knowledge um, and the medical experience that I currently have, everything looks like it is normal. Here we have um, the bed where the baby will be when he or she pops out. Um, we are not sure, but they like to cover their bases here at West Penn. They give you a hat that is pink and blue striped, um, just to make sure that they don't pick a favorite. Um, I would say this is about a, a, a full bed, I think. Probably a full. Um, pretty firm mattress, definitely not comfy. Um, but the baby won't remember it when they're older. We have a TV here, flat screen, state of the art, LG, nothing but the best here at West Penn. And uh, I, I just used the bathroom recently and the toilet flushes the best. Sorry that I abrupt, I abruptly stopped that video. Uh, the nurse came in to, to, to deliver, I'm sorry, not the baby, don't worry, but to deliver uh, ice chips and a cup of coffee. I was told that it's Folgers. You know what they say, the best part of waking up is Folgers in a cup. I'll have two cups. Definitely not the best coffee, but definitely not the worst. It's a bit on the weak side. Um, I will talk to maybe Mr. West Penn about the coffee choices. I'm thinking maybe they should get Convive in West Penn. Can vibe coffee in West Penn? Never was an early ride. See if I can pull some strings. Used to be I just went to the car and got all of our belongings. Um, the lady at the desk asked me if we were moving in. I kindly said no, only staying here for a short period of time. But, gonna dig into some snacks, courtesy of Jansen. Thanks for packing these. We have our Gardettos, family size, original recipe, check this followed by a healthier item of veggie straws with sea salt to wash it all down with some classic old fish. Jansen, how you doing over there? <laughs> it is 9.58. She's going strong. Is it 10.45? It's 10.56 now. 10 10.45. Okay, called it at 10.45. 10 centimeters dilated, 20 minutes, and then she's gonna push. And then we're hopefully gonna have a baby. And by me, I, we, I mean, she's gonna have a baby. I'm gonna hold her heel, apparently. So, and announce the gender. All right, that's it. Baby has been born. I believe the exact time was 12.56. We are still waiting to get the baby's weight the measurements but say hello to Scarlett May Jameson
funny how everything I dreamed about starts to seem so empty without you. It's the way you're smiling at. First and foremost, I apologize for the mop of a hairdo that I have upon my head. I took a shower yesterday and felt no need to put product in my hair. Today's discharge day. We are leaving the hospital around 2 o'clock. It is 11.50 right now. So we're going to do some tests here in order for us to be able to leave. And then... Um, We'll be going home with our daughter, Scarlett Mae Jameson, to hang out. Um, we are quarantined, so she's gonna get all the hangs in with mom and dad over the next few weeks. Um, but she's healthy, eating well, and she is perfect. Can't wait to hang with my daughter in our house. And shout out to my amazing, beautiful wife for pushing Scarlett out, getting her into this world. And so far, literally being the best mom ever. I love her and I love my daughter and our little family. Never was an early riser, used to be enough all night. Never saw the morning light quite like I do now. Never said no to a party, never started saving money. Everything is different since you've been around. It's a way you're smiling at.